Hey there, this is Samich, and welcome back to Waking Up. Last time, we went into We All Burn and got the purple wool. And this time, we're going to head back to Intersection 3 and take on, I believe I'm going to go to Frozen Venom today. And I'm using a bunch of these enchanted iron swords I have left over that are about to break just to get them out of the way. I have three of them that are almost broken and then a fresh iron sword. I'm hoping that I'll be able to get me through Frozen Venom. Hmm, what else should I talk about? Oh yeah, I used this uh, pick to get a bunch of torches. I'm not going to take all the torches with me. I'm going to put a few in the chest up um, by where I got the Rosian battle gear that I've already lost. Annoying, but whatever. So I can see the moon with my render distance, I believe set to normal. Maybe I'm on far, I don't know. Anyways, this place is dangerous. Like, I keep getting random spawns, I keep getting baby spiders and blazes all over the place, so I'm gonna try to light it up better on my way to where I'm going. Oh you. You, 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 you almost pushed me. That would not have been fun. Wish I knew where those baby spiders were coming from. Because they were annoying me. Some iron here that I'm going to ignore. There goes that sword. Let's get another sword on my bar. Go away light up this little outcove here so things stop spawning on it. I need to make like a railway through here or something. Some kind of shortcut rail. In fact, this is kind of... Intersection 3, I believe, is kind of close to the first spawn point. I may want to just like dig a tunnel through there until I reach intersection 3. Like take down the coordinates of intersection 3 and like build a railway to it by digging through the wall. I would take a long time without one of those power miners. Anyways, yes, I am using a fortune pick as my primary pick. No, I don't care. So shut up. I'm going to get a ton more fortune picks while trying to get the uh, silk touch pick. Does my music like automatically turn itself back up? Like, every time I play, it keeps getting back to loudness when I always put it to not loudness. Anyways, I'm eating my zombie flesh first. To save my soup for when I need it. And let's head into... Well, first, let's put up some of these torches. Let's take two stacks with us. Why not? In fact, you are not in the right spot. There you go. Now you're in the right spot. To Frozen Venom we go. Because this place didn't seem that bad from what I could remember. Lots of snow and lots of spider webs. The bad joke. Okay, my torches have been unmelting things. Yeah, my torches are uh, melting the ice. Now, I'm going to guess that all of this right here is natural spawns, at least so far. Stop it. You know what? You guys are skeletons. You get shot. By me. Die in a fire. Okay. Okay. 
to put new soup on my bar. There we go. What's this over here? Gravel? I don't like random gravel. I do not trust it. The zombie is slowed. Why is the zombie slowed? Is that a baby spider? Ew, my. A lot of bad things over in this direction. Lots of slowed bad things. Something just broke, and I'm going to guess it's a piece of armor. Man! Lots of things! These can't all be natural spawns. There's got to be spawners in here somewhere, so... Oh, something's blown up. I'm going to run ahead a little bit and light up some. Silverfish! God! Okay, there are no silverfish blocks around here, so that's a plus. Slightly less annoying when they don't have anything to spawn. Oh, baby spider. I need to retreat. I'm taking damage. God fucking damn it. Hug, running back. World loading slowly. God damn it. It sucks, too, because I hit the ground too hard instead of dying like a man from a spider to the face. Okay, frozen venoms, exactly what I expected. Baby spiders and ice. Or snow. Or ice and snow. Whoa! Anyways, on my way back, let's do this. That is a big slime, and that is a creeper. Eep, he's gonna blow. He blew. Take this cobble. I'm going to avoid you, slime, as I do not have any way to fight you. I'm contemplating doing what Vex did in his developer commentary and making a ghast farming area out of Boomer Castle. Because I completely avoided that room. I didn't destroy the spawners like I normally do because I avoided the room. So I could make gas spawn, kill them, get their gas tears, and make some regeneration potions. Which would probably be very helpful. And fall damage. And I'm not regenerating health, and there's a creeper, and the game refuses to run. Okay, I'm walking now. I've heard that if I double tap S, that'll make me run, and it does. That's interesting. It's barely useful, though, because it's kind of hard to press S while you're running. You have to, like, move your fingers off their normal positions. It's just awkward to do. Unless you, like, use the weird fingers. I have my middle finger on W and S, and then A, and, and then my left... Your pointer finger is the one between the middle and the thumb, right? I have that one on D, and then I have the one between my pinky and my middle finger on A. So it's kind of awkward to reach over to... A um, actually, like, this isn't bad, using your pointer finger. You just have to twist your arm a little. But still, it's not very useful. I'd rather just double tap W. And randomly stop running for no frickin' reason. That's nice, too. Wow. Oh, I randomly stopped running because I ran out of food. That's why. So it wasn't random. I seriously need a rail over here. Oh, and there's still things up, oh, and a creeper just spawned, like, right on top of my stuff. That's lovely. Come on, get over here. I need to lure you. Get off of my stuff, douche. OK, 
Okay, I can kill you over here. I don't care. Blow up. Do what you gotta do. You get away from my stuff. Am I picking up snowballs? Okay, let me for one thing get my armor on and get food in my flesh. Okay, that should be good. I just ate a bunch of them at once, so that should improve my saturation a little bit. Okay, what am I doing here? Sword, pick, bow, torches, food, zombie flesh. Let's not waste too much inventory space with frickin' snowballs and just make snow blocks. Why am I doing that? I can just click OK. Um, running out of blocks on the bar, so put the snow on the bar, tap my microphone, because that's what I do. And well, I want the power bow on my bar. I don't want my unenchanted bow on my bar. And that's going to do it, I think. Yep, that'll be fine. Now, I'm going to want to slowly and methodically light this place up. I don't want to get overwhelmed like I did last time. And take out skeletons from afar because they're annoying. Zombies I can take out with a sword because they're less annoying. I say after getting swarmed by them and we all burn. When I first heard we all burn, I expected it to be like we all float, where you had to like swim through lava, only he'd provide us with fire resist potions or something. Now, you see what's happening here? is my torches are melting the ice and the melted ice is taking out my torches which is very interesting and kind of a good oh I do not I do not uh, trust this gravel in the slightest what the blocking 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 Whoa, more explosions, and that's a lot of lag that is happening right now. Okay, go away, spider. Okay, I was wise not to trust that gravel as it exploded in my face. What the? How did he do that? That creeper cheated. He just, like, went down into the ice. Oh, I'm back a little bit, and things shouldn't be spawning here. There's got to be, like, spiders under this water somewhere. I hear them. Yeah, see, there's spawners down there, but why? Well, they're all dying, so it doesn't really matter right now. What am I... What did I come back here to do? I came back here to do something, I think. Well, whatever. Um, yeah, giant explosions. Very nice. Very vex. Go away. Go away. Just shoot the crap out of you guys. Uh-oh. Sword broke. I just get another bow? I think I just got another bow. That's oh, hello. It's one of these things. With 
with the spawners and the um my word this place is a uh, definitely turned into a place wow that uh skelet their zombie survived okay this is a very big crater man And my inventory's got to be full of snowballs. That's why I'm not picking any of them up. Well, I don't feel safe here, so I'm going to retreat and then get rid of all the snowballs in my inventory. And put a sword on my sword position on my bar so I stop just randomly pulling out a bow. All the ice is melting, which is, again, annoying because it's taking out my torches. Okay, the spawners can stop spawning. The silverfish can die in a fire. Okay, and let's get rid of all these frickin' snowballs. Ooh, my armor's not looking so hot. Okay, let's put my sword here. These swords might not be enough, now that I think about it. Hmm. I may have to retreat and take another path back. Hey, gravel, that totally doesn't look suspicious. Snowballs rain from the sky. What's the sword even have on it? Smite 2. Should not waste it on spiders. And that, my friends, is a giant hole to spawn things in that will not be useful. Whoa. Whoa! Random lag. Random bat lag. Holy crap. Uh oh. Man, that really drops my frame rate. There is more TNT up there. You see that? Unless that's phantom TNT and is not really there. But I somehow doubt that. Now this is actually somewhere... Ah, oh, man. I definitely see things up there. Now, what I did not expect from Frozen Venom was TNT traps. I expected all the ice, and I expected all the um, baby spiders, but I did not expect TNT traps, so... Hey, you. Stop that. Stop spawning, please. Stop it. Sword broke. Now I gotta use this one. Hey zombies, don't suppose you'd mind dropping me an iron sword? That'd be kinda cool. Man, all these snowballs. Do I even have a use for all the snowballs? Like, I can use the snow blocks as building materials like I'm using now, but... There's no real need... There's no real need. Like, I can use other materials other than... Ow. Snowballs. 
Well, I'm out of food, out of real food, and my armor is almost broken. I want to get new armor, so probably have to retreat. But first, I want to see what the heck's up with the stuff down here. They're not just here to be here. They're here for a reason. Ow. Ow. Okay, maybe they are just here to be here. Let me get out. Let me get out. I'm going to drown. I'm going to drown and lose all my stuff. I changed my... Fuck all the things. Uh... things of soup. I don't know what my cows have done, but apparently this ledge is now their own, so. <sighs> Got tons of soup, so just run back. Don't jump, just run. Jumping's only slightly faster and makes your hunger go down, like, I tried to snap my fingers, but I cannot do that, so instead I made a clicky sound with my tongue, because that's what I do, baby. Okay, back to running. And randomly stop. Let's double click S for... Why not? I wonder if you can set up controller controls for Minecraft. That doesn't sound like something I would want to do because a lot of Minecraft's very precision and using a control stick is not very precise for the most part. Anyway, so far these TNT traps haven't been lethal. I can hear them and I can run and they s most of them seem to be indicated via Bia. Why did I say Bia? Seem to be indicated by the patches of gravel. Which I knew was suspicious, but I thought it was suspicious for a different reason. Always be suspicious of gravel, folks. It's not very nice. Aw, oh, this spider's gonna troll me. Jump over him. Suck it. What I need is milk. Can you milk mushrooms? With, you know, buckets to get buckets of milk? I honestly don't know. I know you can kill them and get leather and flesh. Flesh of the living, but, uh... That's a good question. Uh, let's take my torches. I'm low on torches too, that's lovely. If I had to guess why those spider spawners are down there, it's because once you place torches near the ice, It'll melt the ice, and then they can start pouring up. Well, I've got more food now, so I guess I can continue on. Why not? Okay, let's check to make sure I'm not missing anything really important that may have fallen into the water there. Okay, nothing can spawn near me. Pants, you, food. Okay, pick on the pick spot, sword on the sword spot, bow on the bow spot. Blocks. What else do I want on my bar? 
What else can I put on my bar? I have no air. Oh, there are my arrows. Hmm. What else do I normally have on my bar? I'm a bear. I'm a bear. Nothing, I guess. Well, let's continue on, see if we can't set off this TNT. That sounds like a smart thing to do. Oh, hello. Hello, multiple of you. Ow, I fell. Haha, -ha, success. Okay, I need to make sure to light this area up because it's in the way. Get rid of all these goddamn snowballs. They just clog up my inventory. Holy crap. It's probably the point, too, to be annoying and just clog up your inventory. Okay, let's get up there. Torch things up. I wonder how come you only get snowballs with a shovel. I mean, you don't need a shovel to get snowballs in real life. You can just grab the... grab it. I hear things going off and I can't run. Okay. Why am I leaving this stuff alive? This dispenser's gone, but this needs to go away. I don't want baby spiders. Was that? That was not the TNT I was planning on setting off either. This place is just full of TNT! Holy crap! It's like a giant explosion fest. This should not be frozen venom, it should be frozen blast, or frozen explosions, or boom, or something. Ow. Well, there goes more of my armor. I'm not going to survive here with no armor. I am playing on hard still, so... Uh, it's not the smart... Whoa! Hello! Not the smartest of ideas. This is... You know what else isn't a smart idea? Walking towards TNT that you know for a fact is going to be set off the closer you get. Exploding. Why am I still in here? This is not the this is not smart. What am I looking at up there? Seriously, what am I looking at up there? It's in before explosion, but oh no, it actually killed me. Died so many times this episode. Do I have any wood left? On the bright side, it looks like my stuff survived, but that's a very small bright side. Wait, 
should bring more armor before I head back because my armor is pretty much dead I need new armor Give me some armor. That's a spider eye. Not what I want. Yeah, looks like I'm going with leather for my helm and boots. There we go. Armor. Awesome. Make me not die quite as much. Should start making iron armor, but I need to make sure I get that silk touch pick. What I need to do is make a rail. Oh my god, this run back is annoying. So, so annoying. And I need to end the episode. I need to just get my stuff back and end the episode. Stop spawning things, darkness. Man, look at all those things. This wouldn't be half bad if this place was completely safe. Like right now, it's kinda sorta safe. Which is not a good thing. That's a lot of lava down there. I wonder if there's stuff hidden down there. I bet there is. Where am I going? I bet there's stuff hidden in here that I've missed. Probably just a lot of ores. It's probably it's just an ore area, I bet. Maybe. Tons of coal, a decent amount of iron, tons of gold. Speaking of gold, I need to collect some for the gold block and for the... Wait, did I make the gold block? I think I might have made the gold block. Or did I? I don't even remember what I did anymore. But yeah, I can start making some gold armor. It wouldn't last at all, but it's better than nothing if I run out of leather. Actually, that's probably a bad idea. I should just make iron armor. There's, there's a lot of iron in here. I can afford to make iron armor. But I'm not going to until I run out of leather. And again, I can breed cows, or breed my mushrooms, and they can give me leather, but... I'm overthinking this, or I'm underthinking it. I don't know. I'm, I'm kind of annoyed right now and flustered. Oh man. Just want to get my stuff back. Get out of here and the episode. That's my current goal. I bet some of my stuff blew up. I bet my pick blew up. That's exactly what happened. My pick blew up and I'm in, caught in a goddamn cobweb. God frickin' let me out! <laughs> Really? You're going to do that to me? You're going to warp me back? Thanks, game. Thank you for combining single player and multiplayer. Perfect decision. No ramifications whatsoever. It's perfect. Absolutely perfect. I'm in rage mode. Uh, I am so in rage mode right now. Just annoyed. I'm not even annoyed at the map, I'm just annoyed at the game in general. Okay, so I was looking at that TNT. And... It appeared to have a grass block on it. And right before my death, I 
heard a chicken. You die. So yeah, right before I died, I heard a chicken. So I bet that grass is there to spawn the chicken. And that the chicken sets off a pressure plate. And that the TNT goes off. That is my theory on how the TNT traps work. Why he decided for chickens instead of his usual baby spiders. Up, oh, creeper, I'm going to die. Need to leave. Something's blowing up. Oh my freaking god, something's blowing up. If I die... This area is significantly more annoying than I anticipated. Just, just get me the hell out of here. Maybe next time I'll go back into We All Burn. Because We All Burn, at the very least, is easy. There's no TNT traps to worry about. There's just two things to worry about. Zombies. And lava. And one giant gaping hole at the end. But There's a skeleton right there. Come to ruin my day. Caught in this frickin' cobweb. Get out. Oh, man. Just get me to the frickin' chest where I put my torches. But I already took out all the torches, so... Oh, man. I'm just gonna put my random crap in these things. Maybe I'll go to the net. No. Don't want to go to the nest. The nest sounds bad. The nest sounds very bad. But my crap I do not need in here. Sword on bar. Pick on bar. Uh, don't need all this frickin' snow. Oh my lord. I have so many bowls. So, so many bowls. <sighs> what am I doing here? I'm putting crap up that I don't need. Actually, keep the rotten flesh in case I run out of Spencer's. Okay. Next time, doing something. Rage quit. Bye. See ya. See you guys then. Bye. Bye. Goodbye. See ya. Bye. Goodbye.